Hi everybody, it's Nani. How you doing today? I am great. I'm back with my Dollar Tree haul. I want to show you what's in the stores right now. Found some really good stuff. Did you guys see what was in my thumbnail? I found this. It's Harry's brand. I actually did look these up on the Walmart app. If you have the Walmart app, there's a scanner feature. Same with the Dollar Tree. On their app, there's a scanning feature. I checked it at Walmart. These are like $12. I found two different things. This is the Harry's scalp cream. It soothes and hydrates and it's a four ounce, looks like a little serum, like squeeze bottle. We're gonna go ahead and just see what this is. Oh, it comes out like a, a cloudy, runny, almost serum. I wanna smell what this is. I'm assuming these are for men. It does have a scent to it, but nothing horrible. Why? Well, I guess women could use this too. I don't know anything about this product, but I have heard of Harry's before. And this is the Scalp Scrub. It exfoliates and invigorates, and it's a five ounce tube. So these are the only two things I found. I don't know what else is out there. If you guys know, please let me know. I think this was like $12 and a few cents, and this was $11 and something. That's awesome. So I'm gonna see what this is, see if it is not sealed either, but it does look gritty. That smells nice. I just got it on my face. I do that every time I smell something. So if you guys know anything about this, please let me know. On the back of this one, the scrub, it says a cleansing, stimulating sugar scrub that helps dissolve the gunk that cleans to your scalp. Use it once a week to do the trick before shampooing is what that says. And this says it soothes a dry or irritated scalp. Hydrating leave-in treatment apply daily or as needed. So pretty cool finds, I think. When you can find $12 products, name brand products for $1.25, why not? Somebody will scoop those up in my family. I have a few big things here, so I wanna go ahead and get them off my desk. I needed some new containers just to put cookies, things like that in, and they had these this time. And I don't know if it says the amount these will hold. They're not super big, but they'll get the job done. It's just called a container. They had these ones with the snowflakes and the red and green candy canes. Just remember to get the lids. They had all of the containers kind of stacked up inside of each other, and then the lids were kind of setting separately. So make sure to get the lids if you pick these up. But they had this print. I thought that was super nice. Then they had the blue with the different colored blue snowflakes. And then they had the red reindeer with the white snowflakes. I don't have that lid on tight, but it, it does fit. And they do have a pretty nice close to them. So I got one of each of those. That should be plenty. Really cute just to have... You know, you're making a bunch of cookies just to have sitting around. At least the containers look cute. All right, let's put those on the floor and out of my way. Food. You guys were telling me there were other flavor combinations in this brand, and I found some. These are the Barton's brand, the Cashew Clusters, and it's cashews, caramel, and crispy rice drenched in a smooth milk chocolatey confection, and it's three ounces. We did try the other flavors that we got, the salted caramels. Oh, they are so, so good. And then I can't remember what the other one was. Was it like peanut with Rice Krispies or something? I can't remember. They were good. So I'm really looking forward to these. I love cashews beautiful gift basket you could make someone. And then they had the Barton's peanut butter clusters. These are delicious milk chocolatey clusters filled with creamy peanut butter and roasted peanuts. Also a three ounce. If you have just somebody that you want to give a little something to and you don't know what to get, these are nice. And these are made, one of you actually pointed it out to me, these are made in Allentown, Pennsylvania. And you know, the thing is, I never heard of this company before. A lot of you were saying that this was kind of the, the name brand chocolates as you were growing up. 
I've been a Pennsylvania girl all my life. I had never heard of this company. With us, it was Russell Stover's and Russell Stover's. Is that right? Why does that not sound right? I think it's right. And we had Gardner's candies and but these are good. Picked up a thing of the croutons, 20% more. We get these a lot. They're good. And they're the Newfield brand. Eat fresh. These are the garlic croutons. And you get six ounces in here. Nice big bag. Excellent to have around for the holidays. If you're making salad with your Christmas dinner, whatever. I like eating them just straight out of the package. I love croutons. If we go anywhere and hubby gets a salad, he's not a super big fan of the croutons. So I always end up eating his. I love croutons. And they do have um another flavor. Is it just plain maybe, I think? But these are the garlic. So good. And you guys were telling me these were out there. I picked up a bag in the sour. And they're going to get passed along to the kids because I don't like sour candies. You guys told me they had the regular flavors. And this is apparently it. That says new. Colors are from natural sources. These are the Tic Tacs. Fruity Adventure, a crunchy outside, chewy inside, and it's a 2.8 ounce bag. And then it says on the back, the flavors are cherry, lemon, orange, apple, and grape. Best by January of 26. And you can see they're, they're a bigger Tic Tac. So I'm looking forward to giving these a try. That was it for the food things. I think in yesterday's video, I was showing you, we picked up some dog treats for all of the dogs in our family for Christmas. This time, Hubby picked up some of the cute little squeaky toys. At least I'm assuming they squeak. Yes, squeaker inside. So if you guys have any dogs nearby, I'm going to try to squeak this and see what it does. I'll only do this one. It does. It squeaks. Look how cute this is. They're $1.25. I believe everything in this haul is $1.25. This is the Twizzlers. Look how cute. I'm sure the dogs in our house will have these chewed apart within 10 seconds, but it is what it is. Then they have the Reese's Peanut Butter Cup. How cute. And these are a nice size too. They're not tiny, tiny little, little toys. And the Hershey's Candy Bar, Chocolate Bar. Look how cute that is. And I'm assuming they all squeak. Yes. I have no idea what other ones were out there. He's the one that picked these up. They're adorable, though. Have to remember the pets at this time of the year, too. Got a thing of the multi-purpose cement. I have no idea what hubby is going to use this for. But he likes it. He has picked this up in the past. This is an all-purpose adhesive for common household repairs. It dries clear, a rigid bond, and a precision nozzle. And it bonds with wood, metal, ceramic, china, porcelain, leather, fabrics, and most plastics. And it's a 0.5 fluid ounce. I don't know what he needs this for, but obviously he needed it. Who knows? This time of the year... We all need some of this. This is the Value Health by Spirit brand. It's the pain relief, extra strength, acetaminophen, 500 milligrams, and you get 40 capsules in here, caplets. And these are compared to extra strength Tylenol. I like this. This works well for us. I like having it on the shelf. And I was out, completely out. So I don't use a lot of this type of product. But when you need it and you don't have it, you wish you did. So this is what I need. It's going to get opened up, put in the cabinet right now. I really like this. And they also have the, um, this is the acetaminophen. They also have the ibuprofen as well. And I believe they had different styles of this. Maybe capsules or something. I can't quite remember. But this one you get 40 in. So that's why I get it. This will last me forever. It'll it'll be in the cabinet a year from now. For myself, I picked up this. I know I picked up some of these other things before, but I can't remember ever seeing this. 
It is by Be Pure. It's the pressed powder for acne prone skin clarifying with salicylic acid, a 0.17 ounce. And it came in fair and they also had it in a darker shade, but I knew it would be way too dark for me. So I want to go ahead and open this and see what this is about. I'm willing to try different powders and things. This looks way darker out of the package than it did in the package. How do you get it out of there? It just pops out. I would just want to go ahead and test it, swatch it for you guys, let you know what it's like. It does have a slight scent, but nothing horrible. This is for me, so see, it does look a lot darker. Maybe not. Maybe not, guys. That That's nice. Very smooth. When you put it on your skin, it just kind of almost feels like it melts right in. It is, it is a very nice, finely milled powder. And I don't know if there was a lighter shade than this. There was none in my store, but I don't know if there is one out there or not. But that's a pretty nice match for me. And that's in the shade Fair. And I'm pretty fair. So I'm willing to give that a try and see how this see how this works. I don't have acne prone skin, but that kind of stuff doesn't really doesn't really affect me in any way. I'd use it no matter what. But yeah, I'm kind of impressed with that color shade. I didn't think that would work, but nice. So all right, everybody, I'm looking here. That's all that I got for you today. I'm going to go ahead and get all this stuff put away, move along with my day. I hope you're doing well. If you like this type of thing, please subscribe. I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family. You guys are the best. Have a great day, everybody, and I'll talk to you again here really soon. Peace.